Hello YouTube. Happy International Women's Day. Woo! If you connect with the word woman, if you identify as a female, happy day. <laughs> if you know someone who identifies as a female or enjoys using the word woman, congratulate them today. It's not an easy path and it takes a lot of us to make up whatever that word means. This last year has sucked. For me, the thing that has kept my feet on the ground have been the incredible wisdom and conversations that I've had with the other people that identify as women that are in my life. So I thought we'd do something a little bit different today. <laughs> Woo! This video is actually going to be a little compilation of the incredible women that I know both professionally and personally who have come together to answer the question, what advice would you give your younger self? Wishing you so much love today. Here it is. If I could give my younger self one piece of advice, I would probably tell her to accept being weird and being a nerd and being passionate about very different things that her friends might be because being a nerd is really cool. And also those are the things that connect you to other people. I would tell my younger self, definitely never take it personal because it's not personal. And if you're coming from a loving place, be as big as you can be, contribute, participate, never apologize for that. And remember, don't spend a lot of time trying to please everybody because it's simply not possible. Nurture the things that you're passionate about, even if it doesn't make sense to anyone else. Never allow anyone to dim your light, shine on and shine bright. Hold on to the things that sing to your soul and make you feel warm, that speak to you in an octave that is pleasant to your spirit. Remember that there is no greater and more important love than the love you give yourself. You're gonna be okay. I know it seems simple, but what I needed to know most, specifically in my high school years, college years, and middle school years, is that I was going to be okay. If I could give my younger self one piece of advice, that would be to stay strong, to to know that not everyone is is judging you not everyone is is out to get you or um, will hurt you you have a strong mother a strong example in front of you of what it is to persevere against a lot of odds and to to believe in the journey that is set out for you take it one day at a time one thing that i would tell my younger self is just to enjoy the journey to believe in myself to do things that are meaningful and that you think can make a difference and that's advice that i still follow today my advice to my younger self would be slow down find balance and your career is for you to enjoy. The only goal you can accomplish is the one you don't go after. Exhale, be kinder to yourself, relax, take it easy, drop those shoulders down because the universe has your back and you are going to be okay. Trust your own instincts. I think that I spent a lot of time and energy worrying about other people's opinions um, about what I should be doing or the direction I should be going in. And when I finally let go of that, it was very freeing. I would tell my younger self that everything is gonna be all right. Growing up as a trans woman, life definitely isn't easy. Things will be all right. I know things may not look like they'll be all right in the end, but you're gonna be good. You're gonna follow your passion. You're gonna fall in love with sticking up for yourself and growing confidence. You're gonna find the love of your life. You're gonna have an amazing life filled with so much love, but most of all, joy. Joy that you are currently missing, but it's coming back. My advice to my younger self would be not to worry too much about the things that don't make you feel good, whether that's people, things that you're not so good at, anything really. Just focus on the things that make you happy and the rest will all take care of itself. To not worry so much about the numbers, the years, to not fear aging. I guess what I'm saying is like, as you age, I feel like you get more fearless. It's a really, really wonderful, miraculous adventure. Oh, I guess I should, I guess I should answer my own question. Okay, the advice that I would give my younger self is that you do not have to earn your right to speak. It is your God-given right. 
I'm gonna be replaying this video over and over again. Not just today, but anytime I'm feeling a little tweaked. So um, I wanna thank all of the incredible women who participated in this video. I'm in awe. And I'm sending love to all of you out there, however you identify, whatever words, terms, pronouns feel right to you. I love it. I appreciate it. Thank you for being you. I can't wait until we meet in person one day.